A huge Amazon Web Services outage has taken down a large portion of the internet. While the exact cause of the issue isn't yet clear, the AWS dashboard showed an operational issue in Northern Virginia, one of its biggest data centers. The National News Desk, Jeff Harris, joining us. Needless to say, this caused a major interruption, Jeff. This outage affecting millions of users across the world, like airlines, banks, social media platforms, etc. Break down what we are learning tonight. So as of tonight, Amazon says that its systems are effectively back online, despite some experiencing lingering problems with AWS. The issue first starting early this morning when a large spike on down detector began showing multiple different issues. Hours after millions of users were left in the dark Monday, AWS calling the outage a DNS issue. Emery's Ramnath Chalapa explaining that's the service that translates human readable internet addresses into machine readable addresses. When you type Amazon.com, it doesn't matter uh, what name you use, what matters is the uh, actual internet uh, protocol number. AWS is a cloud computing platform that provides IT resources like computing power and storage over the internet. And it's not small. Market research firm Gartner reporting last year, AWS accounted for 37% of the global market share with some big name customers like the NFL, Capital One, Disney, and the U.S. Army. One small AWS glitch and then the whole uh, digital world needs a reboot. The outage Monday affecting people and businesses across the world. According to CNET, down detector saw over 9.8 million reports, 2.7 million coming from the U.S. and 1.1 million from the U.K., including United Airlines, McDonald's, and Venmo. Amazon saying late Monday afternoon its systems are mostly back online, but we continue to observe recovery across all AWS services. Technology expert at Cedarville University, Micah Cooper, tells us the outage doesn't seem to be linked to a cyber attack, including foreign actors. Your nation state does not want to be discovered. Your nation state wants to slip in, uh, obtain, obtain data, and lie quietly and never be discovered. But Chalapa warns this is a good reminder of why cybersecurity is so important, especially as the world becomes more centralized all over again. And if something happens there, that is going to, that impact is going to cascade, and we're going to see it in uh, but multiple levels. Now, this isn't the first time AWS experienced an outage. Back in 2023, many internet services were affected by a brief outage, and in late 2021, a wide range of businesses were affected for more than five hours. Reporting for the National News Desk, I'm Jeff Harris.